magandang buhay welcome to my channel Nike TV uh, nandito ako ngayon sa Franklin Art Center in Pukekohe, New Zealand uh, to see the painting exhibitions of the three young Filipino artists So come in the cheek, we will we will try it. Oh hi there. Here there's an exhibition open an exhibition. Is it okay for you to register? No, that is Jeep. Jeep. When do they call those things? Jeep. That's right. And that's definitely different. I don't know, you ask them. Um, so my name is Lovely Marilette again. 
Um, I'm a teacher by profession, but I love art. And since growing up, that's been my main thing of um, sort of as my diary almost. Um, so a lot of my inspiration for my artwork is being a migrant in New Zealand. Um, I was born in Saudi Arabia, but have lived in Philippines in my childhood, and I've lived in New Zealand as my, I guess, adult life, pre-teens and stuff. Um, so a lot of the artwork that I've done um, is related to um, the migrant hope of like having my parents live overseas while I lived in the Philippines. And so that's been a big inspiration. Is that like as a kid, I always hoped to be with them, and that's sort of a big part of the, my two paintings. Is that um, I can now say um, part of what, which means I've arrived at my destination because I'm with my family. They're about to arrive soon. Uh, so. That's been the inspiration of my piece of the work. Okay, um, for me, I'm Lindsay Yagen and I'm an aspiring artist. I'm um, very curious about all things creative filmmaking, um, graphic design, and painting, and all types. So I want to try and be the jack of all trades and all the creative um, mediums. But yeah, I think the inspiration for my art is basically like a childlike um, visuals of everything and so I play around with like childhood games back in the Philippines or um, what kids like to eat um, and sweet treats and all of that and any childlike dream um, I get inspired by those because as a young kid I'm very like curious and um, I visualize things a lot and imagine a lot of things so that's where my artwork is inspired. Um, for me, um, I'm going to Franco and I, I like to, I like to create. I like to make content. I like, I like to express my creativity more so for um, having the ability to tell a story. Um, that's more for expressing my own emotions. Um, I like to create art because I want to be able to um, tell the story of um, what I imagine on the daily and what I dream about when I sleep and I think the best way I can communicate that to people is through my art and I love all sorts of, um, as you can see my the paintings, the, the one with the boat and the clouds and the little kid in the um, dark room, it's, um, it's more for a very surrealistic approach, I really love surrealism, I, I I took a lot of influence from uh, Salvador Dali and this, um, this I've taken influence from everywhere as long as it's surrealistic. I'm really into surrealism. Um, so that's my influences in my art and the stories that I tell in these paintings are really shaped by my childhood experiences, especially um, not having, being directly impacted by um, the disasters in the Philippines, like um, the typhoons and stuff. Um, I've been one of the lucky ones that have um, lived through that and survived through that and lived a fortunate life than, better than most. And I think that um, I have the power to tell um, the stories of so many Filipinos and the hardships that they come across and the, the beauty of uh, Filipino culture. Is that all? 
so you don't have to do it again. You guys <laughs> No, I don't have to say anything again. Do it 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 again. Uh, from at what time do you usually open here? To four thirty p.m. From eight thirty. Nine thirty. Oh, nine thirty to four thirty. Mm -hmm. Starting tomorrow until Mon Monday, Monday to Friday, then Saturday is nine thirty to two thirty. Okay. Oh. Yeah, I just saw it in Facebook. <laughs> ah, you know, <laughs> the Facebook post. I post. I don't know. Monday, Monday, what? 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 Inspired sa game na Luxong Baka. Ah, Luxong Baka. Reverse, so yung Baka naman nag jump over sa Baka. Yeah. So this painting um, inspired by the Filipino game, Luxong Baka. It's the cow that jumps over the kid. It's another kid jumping over. I know Luxong Baka. Yeah, it's really fun. Yeah. Did, uh, is that yours too? No. No. My other one is my own. Which one? Third one. A ah, third one. That's a new pahate. Yeah, so it's my kubo. Bahay kubo, so, yeah. So this painting is called Kubo Sa Isla. And um, it's like having your own island or having your own piece around it. And the river, you know, so, so yeah, you have everything you need. Oh, very good. <laughs> and then here, drop it. Nagtitinda yan ng taho, ano? Yeah, so this is a um, bayan ng taho. Yeah. This is the taho. Um, and these vendors work very hard to sell their taho. And they should be looked up as heroes by the kids because they work very hard. Very yeah, good. <laughs> and then, and then my last one. Ah, that's yours too. Yeah. This one is called... Maria Clara. Um, yeah, you're welcome. Uh, Filipina. So it's like a child's dream of, of fairies and women being in the fairies. Yeah, that's good. Ah, so you've got four. Oh. How about that one, that jeepney? Oh, ah. yeah. It's going to be in YouTube. I've got my YouTube channel, Nike TV. Nike, short for Pinay, N-A-Y. And K K V K I Nike T V because my husband is Kiwi, so me Pina is Kiwi. He's Kiwi too. Yeah, so Nike. I can tell you about this one. So this one is called Parapo. So Parapo is the place that commuters in the Philippines when they ride the jeepney. Um, oh yeah, it's all right. Okay. They can understand the Filipinos okay. can understand. When they write the jeepney, they want to stop and it's good. They use say parapol. So a lot of the inspiration is from my family being separated for a long time. My parents worked overseas while I lived in the Philippines. And so it was always the hope of my parents coming home in the jeepney because my aunties would arrive back. And so I was like... That's the inspiration is that I wanted my parents to arrive in the jeepney and come home to me. And That's so good. It's, it's the story about migrants in New Zealand and the dream of being somewhere in a place. That's good. Um, so that's kind of what's the inspiration of this. And I guess as a final piece, I said, I can now say Karapo because I am in, like, I guess the promised land, of the land with my family. That my husband is Kiwi, he can understand what uh, because he likes jeep. Because when he went there two times, he always say para para. <laughs> yeah, so this one said there's always. You know, this one's my yeah, he likes jeepney. Yeah. He likes to ride in jeepney. Yeah, this one is the same thing where it's like. Ah, that's yours too. Oh. Yeah. So, sabi mi pangalan mo. Lovely Marilyn. Yeah. So, sang sang kay sa atin. Batangas. Ah. Oh. Ito ba hindi ako dun? Sabiya. Two thousand one.
Thank you. Uh, ito po. This, is one. this one is called um, Laro and it's basically um, facing, um, like, children, the youth of Filipinos, um, always finding a way to smile and laugh and basically just have fun despite the, the calamities outside and just the disasters of, that's always been happening to the Philippines, especially all the typhoons. Um, it also represents uh, the Filipino resilience as well. And yeah, and you can do this in the whole and try to play the 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 so, um, Parol is basically a um, representation of the Queen of Hope because the Parol um, is a very big symbol of uh, the Philippines, especially it's Christmas time. And um, the boat, actually, the thing is here. And into this wonderful island is very um, symbolic of my hometown, the Indian city. It's the city of waterfalls. Um, that time, um, I remember it was Christmas Day, that's why I put out the photos, and we had to use boats to navigate, and I feel like I just wanted to play around that, um, with that image that they were sailing and actually finding a trail of hope, a trail of um, serenity and peace into some paradise, and hopefully start brand new again in the world. Yes. Mag hi kayo. Hello po. Makikita kayo sa YouTube. Oh, yeah, the lanterns. Hi kayo. Hello po. Sa YouTube kayo. Taga saan kayo dito? Sa Pakikohe? Sa Istamaki. Ay, sa Auckland. Hindi ko nga alam itong lugar na ito. Nagpa-drive lang sa kapitbahay na. Hindi rin namin alam ito. Kasi baka mamaya maligawa. Kala ko nga late na ako kanina. Sabi ko, dumating ako 4.30.
at the um, welcome in English and then ito yung mga translation niya sa iba't ibang language So, ito yung mga library ng Pukiko. Ayan, nanay ko. Walang papaguran. Uh, dito nagtatapos ang ating vlog today. Uh, thank you for watching. Keep safe and God bless.